Hello, Cindy. How are you tonight? Hello, teacher. I am good. How are you? I am fine. Thanks for asking. How was your day at work tonight? Today? Oh, very good. Excellent. Oh, I'm glad to hear that. Very good. How was your weekend? Excuse me? How was your weekend? A little bit busy. <laughs> yeah. A little bit busy. What about you? Did you get up weekend? Well, uh, I was a little, a little busy just on Saturday. Okay, and then, uh, then uh, Sunday I was off, totally. So it was, it was nice. I could rest. Yeah, very good. Me too. And and Saturday a little bit busy. And uh, yesterday I was uh, at home, but a lot of things to do. <laughs> With a lot of things to do. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay, uh, Cindy, do you have the, the, the Zoom background? Because your face looks, and it's because you have a, ah, and then you downloaded the, the document that I just sent to the WhatsApp group? Oh, let me see now. Uh -huh. Okay, now your face looks okay now. It's probably because you have that Zoom background. What is mean? The Zoom background. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, so that means. That means that in Zoom that you can make background, okay? I don't know, like... Did you find the document? Yes, I got it. Okay. Those are just, we're gonna learn how to make polite requests, okay? In different ways, that's all. Good evening, Alex. How are you tonight? Fine, thanks, and you? I'm fine, thanks for asking. How was your day today? It was good. It was good, okay. I'm yeah. glad to hear that, very good. Okay, uh, could you download the document that I sent at the WhatsApp group? Right now? Yes, I sent it like uh, 10 minutes ago. So look in the WhatsApp group. I got it. You got it. Okay, very good. Maria Mestina, how are you tonight? Turn on your microphone, Maria Ernestina. Good How evening, teacher. How are you? Fine, I'm you? Fine. Thanks for asking. How was I your day at work tonight, today? I I was I was the, I was make the homework. I was doing doing my homework. I was doing my homework. I okay. was doing my homework. Uh, very good. And uh, were you able, I just sent a document to the WhatsApp group. Yes, I, I see. I see the it. document. Okay. You very can, good. Yes. Have it in hand, please. Very good. Now, Guadalupe, turn on your microphone, please. 
Hi, good night. Good evening. How are you tonight? I'm good. I'm okay. I'm relaxed because of my case. I'm on vacation. Okay, very good. And how was your day today? Uh, easy. Ah, you got busy. Don't worry about it. I'm going to relax tonight, okay? I stay in home all day. Ah, you stay home all day. Yes. Guadalupe, were you able to download the document that I sent to the WhatsApp group? No, I didn't receive anything. I, I, I'm not included in the WhatsApp group. Ah, you're not included in the WhatsApp? No. Okay, no, uh, yeah. let me see if I can send the document through through uh, through the can who who has to include me in the group? Uh, now uh, the support the support team, but you can you can I include yourself. Them. There is a link that they send you. Man. I did it, but I can. I don't know why. Really? So, call. Uh, do you not? Do you have the number of the support team? Yes, I have one. Um, okay, call is, them and tell them to add you up to to guide you to get incorporated to the WhatsApp group. Okay. There is a person. The name is Oscar. The name Oscar. is yeah. Oscar Rodriguez, but. He didn't answer me yet. Really? Try again. Try again. Now let me see. Let me see if I uh if I can go to the okay. I am in the in the group. Let me see. Uh, I think they send you some information. Let me see. Right now I will send you that information. Okay. Hold on. Where? Don't, don't, uh, I will send it to the WhatsApp group, that information, okay? How to get into the WhatsApp group, okay? Hey, what's up, man? Yes, wait a minute. I'm trying to get that information. Maybe I can do it for you, okay? Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Let me see. Okay, go to the chat. Okay, can you see it now, Guadalupe? Go to the chat and it says Grupo de WhatsApp, and then you have a link. Guadalupe, turn on your microphone, please. Hello, Karen, how are you today, Karen? Turn on your microphone, Karen. <laughs> Hi. I am fine. Okay, how was your day at work today? Thank you, Norma. Have a good day. Ah, it was a good day. Okay, Guadalupe, can you hear me? Turn on your microphone, Guadalupe. Can you hear me? Yes. 
Good evening, Jordana. How are you tonight? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good night. I'm fine. Thank you. What about you? I am fine. Thanks for asking. Good evening, Ivan. How are you tonight? Hello, Ivan. How are you tonight? I am fine. What about you? I am fine. Thanks for asking. Okay. Thanks so much, Okay, good evening, Tatiana. How are you tonight? Tatiana, turn on your microphone, please. Hello, good night, teacher. Very good. Very good. Okay, uh, I don't know if uh, Guadalupe can hear me. Yes, I can hear you. In the chat, go to the chat, and I send grupo de WhatsApp, and there's a link. So click on the link and you immediately gonna be uh, doing the, joining the WhatsApp group. Is that clear? Yes, but, uh, okay. I don't okay. have in, uh, the WhatsApp in this, uh, this tablet. Uh, I have okay. it in... Do it with your cell phone, okay? Yes, I will do it there. Okay, very good. Good evening, Lily. How are you tonight? Good evening, teacher. I'm great. Thank you. Okay, very good. So, guys, we're going to start, and we're going to start with this, okay? Perspective. Can you see the screen? Hello, guys. Can you see the screen? Yes, no, no, teacher. Yes, no, teacher. Can you see it now? Yes. Yes. Okay, now, yes. these are polite requests, okay? So listen to the request. Well, listen, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to read the request. Okay, listen to the request people make of their neighbors. Have you ever made a similar request? Has anyone ever asked you to do these things? Number one. Could you please tell me the next time you have a party? I like to make sure I'm not at home. Is that clear? Number two, can you turn the stereo off, please? The walls are really thin, so the sound goes through to my apartment. Would you mind closing the door behind you and making sure it locks? We don't want any strangers to enter the building. Would you please tell your guests to use the visitor parking spaces? A lot of cars have been using my space recently. And at last, would you mind not putting your garbage in front of your door? It's not very pleasant to see it in the hallway. Questions about pronunciation or vocabulary? No questions? No, no questions. Are you sure? Yes. Everybody? Yes, sir. What is, the, what, is the, what is the meaning of hallway? What is the meaning of? Hallway. Ha, hallway, pasillo. Hallway, okay. pasillo. OK, thank you. But, but remember, uh, in the supermarket is not a hallway. In the supermarket is called aisle like this let me show you in the supermarket that is called an aisle okay in the supermarket is called an aisle not a hallway is that clear hello yes, yes? yes very yes, good very good so that is, okay, so. Can you, excuse me, can you send me again to the link, please? The link in the chat? Yes, please. But uh, can you go to the chat? Yes, right now. Okay, let me see, let me see where is. 
Okay, chat, the chat. But the link is in the chat, Guadalupe. I can see it. Yes. It's on the bottom. It says, at first I send a document, but you cannot get it. And then the link is right there. A group of the WhatsApp, the Mi Para Todos, 802, group of the WhatsApp, and there is the link. Are you able to see it? No. In the chat, in the chat. Click, yes, uh, click it says chat. I just see it, but I can't see it. What? Wait a Okay. Okay, now let's do something. Okay, minutes before I will send it to your personal WhatsApp, okay? Tonight. Okay. Okay, Thank you. very good. Oh my goodness. chuchito. <laughs> okay, very good. So guys, here we go again. Okay. Now, uh, so these are polite requests. They're supposed to be polite because we say please. So could you please tell me the next time you have a party? And then this is a compliment. I like to make sure I'm not at home. Another polite request is, can you turn the stereo off, please? The walls are really thin. So the sound goes through yeah. my apartment. Would you mind closing the door behind you and making sure it locks, please? We don't want any strangers to enter the building. And the next one, would you please tell your guests to use the visitor parking spaces? A lot of cars have been using my space recently. And the last one, that is a negative, would you mind not putting your garbage in front of your door? It's not very pleasant to see it in the highway. Okay, so those are requests. Now, which are reasonable, which are unreasonable, we are not going to explain that. Because the main focus of tonight's class is this, request with models and would you mind? So model plus simple form of the verb. Can you turn the stereo off, please? Could you close the door, please? Would you please take your garbage out? Is that clear? With, with modal auxiliaries, can, would, and would, uh, can, could, and would. Now, obviously here, we have that please, okay? That can go at the end. Will you take your garbage out, please? It can go there too. And using will you mind, we'll use will you mind plus the verb with ing, which is your own. Will you mind turning the stereo down? Will you mind closing the door, please? Will you mind not putting your garbage here? Is that clear? Yes, teacher. Yes, are you sure? Yes, yes, teacher. Okay, now, match the request with the appropriate responses, okay? Now, could you lend me $20? What is the appropriate response? Letter D. No, no, don't tell me letter D. Tell me the sentence, please. Are you kidding? I don't have, a, have any cash. That is correct. Could you lend me $20? Are you kidding? I don't have any cash. Do you have any questions? No. Hello, do you have any questions? No, no? Not teacher. Okay, now number two, can you get me a sandwich? What is the correct answer? I'm sorry, I'll do it right away, no. No? Sure, not a problem. I'd be glad to. Uh huh. Sure, no problem. I'll be glad to. Is that clear? Yes. Yes, everybody. Okay, very good. So the next one. Can you help me move to my new house? What is the response? The correct response. I'm really sorry, but I'm busy. I'm really sorry, but I'm busy. Okay, very good. Would you mind not sitting here? Sorry, I didn't 
realize this seat was taken. That is correct. Sorry, I didn't realize this seat was taken. Okay, very good. Number five. Could you move your car from my space? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'll do it right away. I'm sorry. I'll do it right away. Very good. And would you mind not talking so loudly? I'm sorry. We'll talk more quickly. We're sorry. We'll sorry. talk more quietly. Very good. Okay. Now, uh, repeat after me. Could you lend me $20? Could you lend me twenty dollars? Everybody, turn on your microphones, please. Of course. Okay. Would you lend me twenty dollars? Could you lend me twenty dollars? Are you kidding? I don't have any cash. Are you kidding? I don't have any cash. Okay, the next one. Uh, can you give me a sandwich? Can you give me, me a sandwich? Sure, no problem. I'll be glad to. Sure, sure, sure no, no problem. problem. I'd be glad to. Can you help me move to my new house? Can you help me move the new house? New house. Okay. Uh, I'm really sorry, but I'm busy. I'm really sorry, I'm really sorry but I'm busy. Uh, would you mind not sitting here? Would you mind, you mind not sitting here? Sorry, I didn't realize this seat was taken. Sorry, I didn't realize this seat was taken. Would you mind, would you move your car from my space? Could you move your car from my space? I'm sorry, I'll do it right away. I'm sorry, I'll do it right away. Okay, would you mind not talking so loudly? What you mind not? Would you mind not talking so loudly? So we're sorry, we'll talk more quietly. We're sorry, we're sorry, we'll talk more quietly. Okay. Questions? Questions? No questions. No, no questions. Okay. This is what we are going to do. I want you to practice this. So you're gonna practice two times, okay? So the well, four times actually. The first time, a student A, read the question, a student B, respond the question. When you finish all the questions, a student B is going to ask the question and a student A is going to answer the question. Then you're going to do all these again. Okay, a student A asks the question, a student B answer the question, and again, a student B asks the question, and a student A answer the question. So you are going to do it two times each. Is that clear? Okay, so yes. I'm going to break you into pairs, okay? Let me see how many of you are right here. Let me see. Okay, so how many I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, so I'm gonna make six groups, okay? Okay. Six groups, okay. So you can practice right away. Okay, there you go. Okay, Alex and Cindy go to room number one, Guadalupe and Guille, room number two, Ivan and Lily, group number three. Irving and Jordana, group number four. Uh, Eleonora and Maria Ernestina, group number five. And Karen, Karen and Maria Jose Callejas, go to room number six, please. Okay, Karen, go to room number six. Cindy, go, okay. Karen Galdames, go to room number six, please. Irving, go to room number four, please. Guille, go to room number two, please, Guille. Okay, very good.
Hello. 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 Are Hello. you able to practice? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. sir. Okay. Okay, very good. Do you have the questions and the answers? Yeah. Okay, very good. So I'm going to leave you. Okay, go ahead, practice, please. I'm going to leave you. Okay. I don't have any cash. Okay. Uh, can you get me a sandwich? Sure, no problem. Hello. Okay. So now we are going to do it again. You okay. will ask questions, but now we are going to improvise answers. You know what I mean? Now, can you repeat? Improvise, improvise. Mm -hmm. Maybe we already made the two dia dialogues. Now we can improvise new, new answers. So you made the question, I will give my own answer. Okay. Hello, hello. I can hear you. I'm sorry, Antonio. Okay, hey, hello. you can hear me, right? Yes, this moment is. Okay, very good. I'm bringing everybody. They were working in a small groups. Okay, okay so. They have finished and they are coming back. Okay. Okay. Uh, I don't know. I have sent uh, a document. I don't know if you got it. Yes, I got it. You got it. Okay, very yes. good. Very good. Now, let me see. I need to get something else from here. Exercise nine, pronunciation. Contrast distress in responses. Part A, listen. Let me see, uh -huh, right here. Okay, guys. What's happening? Okay, very good. Now let's let's move on. Okay. Okay. Now, uh, before we go there, I want you to move here. Okay. Uh, Okay, now uh, I sent a document earlier today. I don't know if you got it in the WhatsApp group. Yes. Yes? Yes. Okay, yes, now yes. these are the formulas that we are going to be using. Okay, would you mind plus verb plus ing? Okay, cool plus verb, can plus verb, and cool plus verb. You see, this one don't have. A Jerome form, ING, only would you mind? So all these are we gonna do it with a would you mind? 
Okay, now you have to think about the verb. For example, what is number one? Would you mind closing? Would you mind? Opening a window. Opening. Okay, opening the window, please. Or would you mind closing a window? Is that clear? Yeah. Yes. The one is possible. Would you mind opening a window, please? Or would you mind closing a window, please? Now, uh, what is this one? Would you mind? Give me my okay. card. No. And remember, the verb must be with ing. ing. Remember, when I use would you mind? So would you mind? Do you mind helping me carry my bag, please? Exactly. Would you mind helping me carry this bag? Okay, very good. Now, what is the next one? Waiting. Waiting me five uh, minutes. Would you mind waiting for me? Would you mind waiting for me five minutes later? Okay. Very good. Now, what is the next one? Helping. No, no. Give me the complete request, please. Would you mind, you mind help, helping up your mouth? No. What do we do with a mess? You remember, I show you a, a phrasal Cleaning. verb. What is the phrasal verb? Uh, Don't you mind cleaning up your mess? Ah, okay. Very good. Cleaning up your mess. Would you mind cleaning up your mess? Very good. Excellent. What is the next one? Would you mind opening the door for me, please? Okay, now with this one, we are going to do it with closing. Would you mind closing the door for me? Because in this one, we use opening, okay? okay. So perfect. Okay. okay, perfect, perfect, very good. Now, what is the next one? Use the bird show. Showing me. Showing, remember, we need ING, remember. Okay, it requires oh. <laughs> it requires that I use would you mind plus verb plus ing. Okay, so what is it again? Would you mind? Would you mind would you mind showing me your uh -huh. boarding you class, please? please? Number seven. Would you mind fasting your bell, please? Aha, uh -huh. would you mind fastening your belts, please? Very good. What is the next one? Would you, would you mind remaining in your seat, please? Aha, uh -huh. would you mind remaining in your seat, please? Very good. What is number nine? Would you mind sitting down, please? Sitting down, please. Sitting down, please. Would you mind sitting down, please? Sitting down, please. Very good. Excellent. The next one. Would you mind putting out your cigarettes, please? Uh, would you mind putting out your cigarettes, please? Now, what is the next one? Would you mind having a suitcase, please? Would you mind opening your suitcase, please? Very good. The next one. Would you mind having another seat, please? please? Uh -huh. Would you mind having another seat? Remember, yes, if you don't participate, you're not speaking English. You just ask the audience. You're just a, a person watching what is happening, right? So, what is the next mm -hmm. one? Would you mind, Would you mind lending me some, some money, money, please? Would you mind lending me some money, please? Now, very good. Now, we are going to change. Now, we are not going to use would you mind. Now, we are going to use... We are going to use... It's not smoking area here. We are going to use... Not. Could. Only okay. could. Okay. So... What is what is the correct one? Could you, could you open a window, please? Would you open a window, please? Okay, now what will be number two? Could you, could you help me carry out my bag, please? Uh -huh. Carry my bag, please. 
Could you help me carry my bag? Please? Very good. What is the next one? Put your wait Put your for mind. Mind. Wait next. No, no mind. Remember, you Waiting don't for use me. mind. Okay. okay. Now the exercise was designed to do your mind, but we are transforming the exercise to use good plus verb. Clear? Yes. Okay. Very good. So what is the next one? Could you wait for me? Five minutes. Could you mind waiting for me? No, no waiting. No. Oh, okay, wait excuse me. me. Uh -huh. Could you? Could you, you wait, wait for me, for me five, minutes five minutes later? Ah, later? Could you wait for me five minutes later? Uh -huh. What is the next one? Could you, could you clean up? up your mess? Uh -huh. Could you? Clean up, clean your, up your mess. That's all right. Could you clean up your mess? The next one. Could you close the door for me, please? For me, please. Uh -huh. Could you close the door for me? Very good. Now, another way is that we can use can plus verb. Okay, example. What is number one? Can you open a window, please? Can you open a window, please? Excellent. Number two. Can you help me carry my bag? Can you help me carry my bag? Excellent. The next one. Can you wait for me five minutes later? Later. Can you clean up your mess? Can you clean up your mess? Excellent. Very good. And the last one. Can you close the door for me, please? Close the door, please. Can you close the door for me, please? Okay. So that was using can plus verb. Now, what about using would plus verb? So that will be, would you open a window, please? Clear? Would you open? Okay. Now, what is number two? Would you help me carry my bag, please? Uh, will you help me carry my bag, please? Excellent. The next one. Would you wait for me five minutes later? Five minutes later. Very good. Number four. Would you clean up your mess? Would you clean up your mess? Very good. Number five. Would you, would you close, close the door, the door, for, the door me, please, for, me, for me, please? Okay, would you close the door for me, please? Very good. Now, I want you that in pairs, you do the same thing. Okay, with number six to number 13. Number one, number one. Okay, a student A is going to use would you mind? Okay. A student B is going to do number seven. A student A is going to do number eight. A student nine is going to do number 10 and so on. Right? Mm -hmm. A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B. Is that clear? When you finish, now you're going to use cool plus verb. A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B. Is that clear? When you finish, M plus verb. A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B. No. We're gonna change this one. B A B A B A B A. Is that clear? Yeah. And then we're gonna use wood plus verb. B A B A B A B A. Are we clear? Teacher. Yes. Yes. Uh, excuse me. Um, it means that we can use wood using ing, and we can use wood without uh, using ing. Yes. If we use. Both. Yeah. If you if we use would you mind. We have to use verb plus ing. But if we use would you mind? But if you only use would, you use the base form. Uh, would you open, open a window, window please? Uh, yeah. Would you mind opening a window, please? Understood. Okay? Understood. Thank you. No problem. Now, further uh, explanation to be clear. To be, yes, to be clear. Further explanation where is. I have a question, teacher. Uh, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Right here, we are right here. Let me show you. Okay, so we are right here. Can you see here? Can you yes. turn the stereo off? Can you see the? Can you see the screen? 
Okay, would you mind turning the stereo down? Now, with clothes, would you mind closing the door, please? And with uh, tape, would you mind not putting your garbage here? Now, if you make negative requests, you are going to use the not right here, okay? Mm -hmm. And here, can you... Can, okay, never mind. So you, if you use a negative request right here and not before the Jerome, are we clear? Yes. Hello? Yes, yes. Yes. yes or yes? Yes. yes. Okay, okay, very good. Now, so let's go and work with this. Remember, so the first one we are going to use it, will you mind? Plus verb plus ing from number six to number 13, okay? A student A, number six, a student B, number seven, a student A, number eight, a student B, number nine, and so on. Now, when we finish, we're gonna go with put plus verb with the same thing, 13. And if you want, you can switch in this case. Six, a student B, seven, a student A. B A B A B A. Then practice with can plus verb and switch again. A B A B A B A B. And at last, wool plus verb. And then you can do again B A B A B A B A. Are we clear? Now, yes, question: yes, Does everybody have this page? It's in the WhatsApp group. Hello? Yes. yes. Okay, wait. Yeah, only one person say yes. Let me see. Jordana, do you have the, <laughs> the document? Very good. Maria Jose, yes. do you have the document? Yes. Very good. Antonio, do you have the document? Turn on your microphone. Yes, of course. Okay, Alex, do you have the document? Yes. Yes, Cindy? Turn on your microphone, Cindy. Yes, I got it. Okay, Karen? Turn on your microphone. Do you have the document? Yes. Uh, Guille? Yes. Whoever yes, I have. is going to work with Guadalupe, so please share the document with Guadalupe, okay? Guille? I took a picture. Huh? I took a picture. Ah, you took a picture. Okay, very good. So now, I want you to work in pairs. Let me see. Oh, I forgot to count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay, so one of you is gonna be with three people, okay? So you go A, B, C, A, B, C, A, B, C, okay? Here we go. Let me create uh, six groups again. Okay, here we go. Irving, Lily, and Maria Jose Callejas go to room number one. Alex and Cindy go to room number two. Eleonora and Guadalupe go to room number three. Guille and Jose Antonio, group number four. Uh, room number four, Jordana, Jordana and Maria Ernestina, room number five. And Ivan and Karen, group uh, room number six. So Jordana, go to room number five. Maria, Ernestina, room number five. Uh -huh, Jordana, room number five, please. Hello, Jordana, are you there? Turn on your microphone, Jordana. Okay, very good.
mind having having another seat, please? Okay. Would you mind lending some money, please? Okay. Okay. Now using could. Could. Good. Okay, remember that we have, I didn't put it right here, but then you have can plus verb and would plus verb. Okay. Okay, okay go okay. ahead. Okay. Uh, could plus verb. Okay, perfect. Uh, could you open, could you open a window, please? Excellent. Next. Could you help me carry my bag, please? Excellent. Lily? Could you wait me five minutes later? Okay, wait for me. Could you wait for me five minutes later? Excellent. Next. Okay. Uh, could you clean up your mess? Excellent. Next. Could you close close the door for me, please? Excellent. Next. Could you show me your boring pass, please? Excellent. Next. Could you fasten your belt, please? Very good. Next. Could you remind in your seats, please? Could you sit down, please? Excellent. Very good. Could you put up your Take your rest, please. Okay, next. Will you open your suitcase, please? Wow, you are excellent students, okay? I'm very... Can you have another seat, please? Okay. Could you lend me some money, please? Okay, now remember using can plus verb and then using will plus verb, okay? Two more minutes, so hurry up. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay, I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna go to another room, okay? Okay. 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 Can right? Yes, can. Okay. okay. Uh, I, I can't see because I don't have it. Oh, okay. I start. Okay. Uh, and, uh, what? You don't have the the document? No, I I don't have the two. Uh, the the one and the two. The one. Uh, yes, the one, the first and the second one. I don't have it. I took the picture. Uh, since um. Don't worry. Two. I am sharing with you. No problem. Can you see it? Thank you. No. Let me share with you. Okay. No problem. Thank there you. There you go. Yes, and I remember, we also have can plus verb. You see in the document, I didn't put can plus verb and would plus verb, but you can add them up, okay? Ustedes lo pueden agregar estos dos, can plus verb and would plus verb. Okay, thank you. Okay, go ahead, go ahead, practice. Um, okay. Um, the first one. Uh, I'm gonna do it with can. Okay. 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 Can you open a window, please? Excellent. Next. Mm -hmm. Can you can can you help me carry my bag, please? Excellent. Next. Can you wait for me five minutes later? Excellent. Next. Can you clean up your mess? Very good. Next. Can you close the door for me, please? Very good. Next. Can you show show me your boarding pass, please? Excellent. Number seven. Can you fasten your belt, please? Uh -huh. Can you fasten your belts, please? Belts. Can you can you remain in your seats? Please? Remain. Can you remain? remain. Uh -huh. Can you remain in your seats, please? Mm -hmm. Can you sit down, please? Can you put off your cigarettes, please? Okay, very good. And, and
Okay, very good, guys. Great work. Now, you are able you. to make requests, okay? It doesn't matter with what. Would you mind? Would you mind doing your homework? Okay, could you do your homework by tomorrow? Can you do your homework by tomorrow? Or will you do your homework by tomorrow? Okay, now that is very good. Now, we're gonna go now with responses, okay? So here, okay, now here, uh, think of five unusual requests, okay? Now, forget about this, but about this, apologies. Think of three complaints you have about your neighbors, right? Three requests you want to make. Choose from these topics or use ideas of your, of your own. So would you mind uh, picking up your garbage, please? Would you mind uh, turning down the noise, please? Or would you mind not making too much noise? Or could you please not make too much noise? Okay, or parking, or pets, or security, whatever it is, okay, uh, we have these excuses, okay, different ways to apologize, giving an excuse. I'm sorry, I didn't realize. Admitting a mistake. I forgot, I left it there. Making an offer. I'll take it out right now. Make a promise. A promise, I'll pick it up. I'll turn that down. Is that clear? Hello, is that clear? Yes. yes. Teacher. Okay. Okay. Very good. Okay. Very good. Now, I want you to go here now. These are persuasion strategies. Strategy. How do you make a request? What do you do when someone says no? So read this article with me. Persuasion strategies. In many situations, people try to persuade others to do things. And However, maybe. most people are not aware of how they persuade others. Three different strategies are often used by couples, okay? And by people in business. A hard strategy, a soft strategy, and a fair strategy. Let's see. What are the hard strategies with couples, okay? I get angry and make the other person give in. Give in is ceder, right? I get angry, uh-huh, what? And the other person, okay, I'm sorry. So I just ordered the person to do what I asked. Uh-huh, I, so I can see some people smiling, identifying yourself with that strategy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Now, another hard strategy is, well, first, I try to make the other person feel stupid. Example, I say that I won't give the person a good report on his or her work. Okay. Another strategy is, hard strategy is that I say, I leave if my spouse, spouse does not agree. Okay, I get the others to support my request. Okay, if you don't do it, I leave you right now. No, 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 don't, don't go. I'll do whatever you want. Is that clear? Okay, that is that strategy. Now, the soft strategy. Okay. I act warm and charming, you know, before I bring up the subject. Like, I act very humble while I'm making my request. Hey, do you know? Hey, what a nice night tonight. You know? Hey, you look very good today. Hey, can you pass, okay, can you buy me those shoes that you promised me the other day? Do you understand? Okay, so that is the soft, the soft strategy. This is the hard one. Now, another strategy. I am so nice that the other person can. I made the other person feel so important, so intelligent. No one, no one can do it better. Okay? So, can, you, can you do my homework, please? <laughs> Is that clear? So, made the other person feel so important that it's impossible for them to say no. Now, the fair strategy. I'll say I'll give up a little if the other person gives up a little. I offer to exchange favor. 
So if you do this for me, I do something for okay. you. And couples, hmm, sometimes they play dirty. Okay, next. We discuss our views without arguing. I explain the reason for my request. Now, tell me what kind of strategy is this? Are, golf, or fair? Fair. Okay, what kind of strategies are these? Hard, soft, hard, soft, hard, soft, hard, soft, or a fair. Yeah, please, uh, uh, all the conversation that you have, we are listening to it. So keep it quiet, please. All right. Okay, I understand. I'm sorry for the inconvenience. Yeah, yeah. Okay, thank you. Okay, okay. now, what is the strategy? Wife to husband. Hey, honey, you know, you made the very best coffee. Will I have? a cup of that terrific coffee you make. So what a strategy is that? Hard, soft, or fair? Uh, soft. 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 Okay, very good. <laughs> Whatever you say. Okay, now number two. Father to daughter. Father to daughter. Pick up that mess in your room right now. Can you do anything right? What that? What a strategy is that? Hard. 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 That is correct. Very Hard. good. Number three. Boss to secretary, I need you to stay late tonight to finish the report. You can leave work early tomorrow. Is that okay? So what Fair. strategy is that? Fair. Fair, Fair. right? You offer Fair. a little and you give up a little. Okay, which strategy do you use most often? Don't tell me, okay? <laughs> now, rewrite these sentences. Find another way. Uh, to say a sentence using the words given. Uh, here, take your feet off my chair. So how can you ask for that request? Can you take your feet off my chair, please? Uh -huh. Can you take your feet off my chair, please? Very good. Now, number two. You mind, you mind taking this from the office? Uh -huh. Would you mind taking this form to the office, please? Okay, very good. You're excellent. Okay, now the rest, take a picture. It's going to be homework. So we're going to check it out tomorrow. Take a picture. Hold on, hold on. Take a picture, please. Okay. You got it? Okay. Okay, yeah, now yeah. here. Not teacher. Oh. No, there you Not go. Uh, With picture or without picture? <laughs> thank you, teacher. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. And take a picture of number seven, too. Now, these are the responses. Could you lend me some money? Oh, sure. Okay, so take a picture, answer the, uh, uh, give the responses, and tomorrow we'll check. Is that clear? Yes. Very easy, very easy homework. Okay, that's all. Do you have any question, guys? No. No? Now, remember, no, right now. today we learn how to make requests. Okay, polite requests. Using would you mind, using can plus verb, could plus verb, and would plus verb. And also, to make some responses. Are we clear? Very okay. good. Yes. So now yes. you can do you can do uh, the check number. Let me see. I have it here. You can do check number. Uh, knowledge check number. Come on, don't play with my feelings, please. You can do knowledge check number uh nine i think okay we will see in a minute okay okay 
So knowledge check number four, you already did, I guess, and request with models and would you mind? Knowledge check 1.9, okay? And with that, we only have the reading uh, on uh, exercise 1.11 and that's gonna be tomorrow, okay? And we will be finishing section number one. Is that clear? Yes, so the sir. reading, you can go ahead and do that one. Any questions, guys? No, sir. Not sure. Okay, so work on your platform, okay? Don't fall sure. behind, okay? Always ahead. So start working okay. on your platform. Knowledge check 1.4, uh, knowledge check 1.9, and the reading exercise 1.11, okay? And you're gonna okay. be okay. Any question, guys? Uh, just one, excuse yes, me. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, what about this unit six? Because I got confused how how to make this exercise. Uh, for example, in the exercise number one, could you lend me some money? I have to choose the the right uh, the right answer. Or in in which one you talking about? And the number one when when it says, uh, could you lend me some money? If the letter B says, oh sure, and then. Okay, so let it be said, could you lend me some money? Oh, sure. Okay, now, would you mind helping me? Ah, yeah. Sorry, yes. I can't right now. You cannot say no thanks or <laughs> I forget. <laughs> so the correct answer is, sorry, I can't right now. Mm, I, I, I can't, uh, I need to choose the, the, the right you one. You need to but, choose but, but, uh, which uh, of the three is the correct one. Um, okay. Okay, there's, uh -huh. that's it. Which one of the three mm -hmm. is the correct one? Okay, guys, thank you very much for your time. I'll see you tomorrow. Have a wonderful night, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Don't forget to send me okay. the WhatsApp. Aha, uh -huh. okay, I will send it to you. I, I promise, okay? Okay, thank you. Okay, have a good night, guys. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you Bye. tomorrow. Bye. Let me see, thank you. everybody. See you tomorrow and have a good night. Thank you. Okay. Bye. Thank you. Rest, Thank you. please. Okay. Bye. Bye bye. Bye.